I see those eyes and my walls come down I've spent my life building around yeah. Though I may try, I can't breathe when you're not around I can't help it when And only you know how I've given up. I must confess, you are my weakness. Build me up, you break me down.
Hello guys and welcome to our stream today. Deformia Meditari King 7 vs 404. With me today, <laughs> Alien, welcome brother. Yeah, hello. So, <clears throat> uh, we also have a new commentator for the day. Um, really exciting match. Yeah. The finals. So, how are you feeling today? How are you? I'm feeling really excited. I mean, semi-finals of fast deals. This has been going on for like a month, and finally we've got the um, two one of the two best teams in a uh, Europe and maybe even the world are facing against each other. And I feel like this is going to be a really nice match, really good match. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I have that feeling as well. So I'm really happy that we are uh, finally on that point that we are in the finals today i mean um 404 fight their way to the finals they won against suspect gg in the semi-finals so i think they have a really solid ground to work on how i heard from the manager of 404 that they have some issues with some players so they are playing with a few subs so um i am not pretty sure how a um 404 will deliver today uh yeah that's kind of unfortunate um uh, so talking about the groups what do you think about the groups i mean uh, 404 there were a few good teams but most of them kind of disbanded or just didn't attend so it has been kind of an easy fight for uh, 404 meanwhile dm they got excel uh, they also faced against Saints, so not that easy of a group, is it? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I think DM showed uh, the whole series that they are worthy to be um, first place in this tournament. As you mentioned before, they won against 400, uh, sorry, they won against Exclusive and they won against Saints. And as we know, they are really two top teams. And I mean we today we have a surprise flown zero is gonna play for deformia meditari king seven the first time so um he just joined uh, the m few days ago um as a new talent he's from poland a new uh, european player and i'm really excited to see how he will perform yes it sure will be exciting so yeah uh, <clears throat> just a few minutes till the match uh, starts. I think it's time to introduce our second uh, commentator for today. Yeah. Um. Today we um we have Kami, our new commentator for the Pro League. Welcome, brother, in the stream. Oh, um, hi guys. I'm very excited to be here. This is a, a huge match, so let's see what's gonna happen. Thank you for this opportunity. Yeah, so uh, we will uh, implement a quick intro and then we are heading into the game, guys. So Alien and 
Kami, take it away. <clears throat> yeah, so let's jump into the first round of this uh, final game of Fast Deals a League. So we've got the first kill already. Divas is going to go down, leaving 404 in a disadvantage of players. So the bomb's being planted on B side 3v4 now. Uh, not many kills. Oh, two kills right there. So 2v3 now. That's going to be another player going down from 404. That's a 1v3 situation and... The last player of 404 is going to go down as well, giving the first round to Deformia Meditari. That was a fast round. That was really fast, I will admit. And, uh, yeah. You know, maybe they can step it up in the second round. Let's see what's going to happen. It might not have been the best idea to um, do such a fast rush right. uh, for 404, so yeah. Anyway, so let's see what they have to offer us in the second round. We've got Deformia Meditari with the default to A to B. Um, we can see uh, the new player on double doors here, Pronex on arches. So, UMP in his possession. Let's see what Flown can do here. So, he's going to get flashed, I think. Um, no, no, he's not. Um, that's going to be the first kill for 404. Another kill by them. Shotguns out. So 2v4 now, 2v4. the bomb's being planted on B site once again. Oh, come on, Flown, can you do something? Oh, that's going to be one kill from by Snippy. Let's see Flown here. The enemy's turn is back to him, and that's going to be another kill, to bringing it down to a 2v2. Takes Glock out. That's another kill by Snippy. Flown is going to go down Snippy in a 1v1 situation. He's got the MP7. Let's see what he can do. The bomb's down. Not much time. The bomb's ticking. Oh, he's going to go grab the pistol out and get the kill. That's 2-0 on the scoreboard for DM. Oh, wow. That's how you do it. That was They, they came back. Yeah, I yeah. think 404 is definitely a bit too aggressive at this point. They yes, yes. have to pull back and maybe wait for some uh, K7 mistakes. They're just I, rushing and it's really not working out for them. So as as you said before, they're playing with subs. So maybe it's a lack of communication or a, a teamwork or something that's going on. Cause maybe that might be the problem. Why they're maybe. being so aggressive? Yeah, uh, we will see that uh, further in the match. Anyways, we got Snippy on double doors here. Uh, no, that's uh, London. Pardon me, Pronix. Uh, pardon me. So, uh, God Zero on apartments. Playing kind of aggressive. Oh, that's that might be the first heal. He's gonna get tagged down to 56 HP. Looking around. Can he get the kill? Trying to pre far. That's gonna be the first kill for Deformia Meditari. One, uh, God Zero with another kill. 2v4 now. That's gonna be uh, 404 player. What? He's left in a 1v4 situation and he's gonna get killed through this smoke. 3-0, dominating performance by Deformia Meditari. Yes, sir. Wow, well, the um, K7, King7 came out to win, and they're proving that during this match right here. Yeah, I mean... every opportunity. They have proven a lot in the previous matches as well against oh, yes, Saints Explosive sure. and necessary some of the world's best teams. And yes. this is another challenge by them, but they're confident about themselves, and that confidence is good. M might end them a win, you know. Anyway, so 404 already in the round has lost one player just a few seconds in the round. That's 3v4 situation now. The bombs on A site, they seem to be thinking about rotation. Another player from 404 going down, got zero right there. 2v4 now. 404 with UMPs only facing against AKs. That's legendary. Going to die and Snippy with the finishing kill. Really fast rounds. Really dominating performance by the Formia Meditari. What can I say? There's really not much to say. Wow. No, this match is going differently than I thought. So let's see what... You never know. The first game. Let's see what the other wow. team could bring here. 450 people watching. Thanks, guys, for tuning in. Make sure you support your favorite team in the chat. Anyways, fifth round of the game start uh, starting right now. 4v4 default from the Formia Meditari once again. We got a Snippy here watching middle. That's going to be the entry kill done by 404. Soon after, DM is going to get a revenge. Um, 
Yes, so 2v3 now. The bomb's been planted on B site. Uh, God Zero with the AKR. He's going to get taken down. That's going to be Snippy left in a 1v3 situation. Not much time for him. This might be 4 or 4 first round, first chance. So Snippy looking around trying to find some per people. He's going to get backstabbed, and that's going to indeed be the first round for 4 or 4. All right, so 4 1. I see there might be a comeback here. Uh, yes, there might be. Um, I think 404 definitely has to change up something in the strategies. They have to be maybe less aggressive. Um, something has to be changed because even though they did win a round, it's still not looking good for them. Yes, for sure. So, <clears throat> uh, we got uh, the sixth round of game going on right now. There's one of DM's players with a sniper already. I really, I'm really curious to see what he can do with a sniper because we don't see too many snipers in the Pro League nowadays. So, I'm really curious what God Zero can do with the sniper here. Uh, that's going to be the first kill. Another kill by... Oh, that double kill by Flown. It's really showing he was worthy to be hired in DM, but Legendary soon after is going to take down Snappy Flown with a double kill in this round. Can he get the third as well? That's the question. Anyways, Legendary left with a bomb and a 1v3 situation. He's going to get taken down by Floyd. Floyd with a triple kill. Good job. 5 1 now. Yeah, so, this this guy, Floyd, is definitely showing that he was worthy to be hired in K7. Yes, he's proving his, his talent, trying to get that spot on the team secured. Good on him. Yes, so 5-1, um, 4 or 4 only with one round on their side. This is really not looking good for them, but they're not thinking about changing anything. Anyways, that's going to be the first three kills of the round, bringing it down to a 2v3. Legendary and uh, his teammate left in a 2v3 situation. They do have the bomb, but can they plant it? I don't think they can. So they're going to try and rotate off to... A, it seems like. A few smokes inside. Yeah. That's Desi. Looking around. He's going to see somebody on double doors. That's nice pre-fire done by him. Anyways, his teammate is going to die. And Stezzy soon after got zero with the sniper taking him down. 6-1. Got zeros hitting them shots with the sniper for sure. I mean, there's not really much to say about this game. Like, um, it's really insane how Deformia Meditari is able to bring such a dominant performance in the finals of such a big tournament. So many good teams, so many good uh, stuff going on, and they're still able to dominate in the finals. So, it's really shocking. Yes, for sure. Anyway, so first three kills by the MK7 right here. And that's going to be the last player of 4-4 four, four really quickly to get the Formia. Round. Yeah, that was really fast. Really fast. Uh, so, yeah, 7-1. This might be the last round of this match. Uh, it could have been 8-0, but the uh, Formia Militari, unfortunately, did uh, leave around 4-4-0-4. Four, four, oh, four. So, it's 7-1 now. This might be the last round. I really hope no. I really hope 404 can show something. But it doesn't seem like his 1v4 situation once again wax left with a and UMP only. It. And he's going to be taken. Now that's it. Ladies and first gentlemen, game. first half of Sandstone. That's it. Really quick, really dominant by the MK7. Not much to say, is there? No, not much, not much. They showed they came out there to win, and that's what they did. Now let's see if. The other team could bring something in for the next game. So I think City side is um, easier for most teams, especially when you lack communication and your um, team like doesn't have too much communication, which is what we could see on 404 side. So mm -hmm. they might be doing a bit better on the City side. We will see. I'm definitely expecting, um, and I want to see a fair and a really close match, but. Uh, Currently, it's really not not looking good for 404. They're not showing too much of themselves, you know. 
Yeah, let's hope they bring up their communication and their um, movement. Their execution, um, that's what they need to lock down the CT. So let's see what's going to happen. Yeah, so a fun fact, uh, 404 is actually full French team. So they should have a bit better chemistry working together because they have the same language and it's way easier to speak between themselves. So uh, they should have a better communication. But um, yes. I'm not too sure what's happening with them, you know. Uh, I, in my opinion, they were playing too aggressive in this match. They were just rushing too much and uh, there wasn't many strategies we could see from them. That's really what they were missing. And we could also tell they weren't checking their corners. They were just rushing head in into uh, on the site. They weren't checking anything, no pre-fires going on. So let's hope they step it up because K7 is using that to their advantage and is outplaying them in every situation they get. So. Yeah, just another final where K7 is... Yeah, so uh, let's jump into the second half of this game. We got 404 on the CT side now, uh, K7 on the T side. It's a full, uh, oh no, that's a three man B, three man A, one man B. Uh, the stat, what do you, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Anyways, <clears throat> so we got Snippy on long here, getting one kill. He's going to go for the knife, minus 99. He's going to get the knife kill. The bomb plant going down on A site now. Got zero with the Deagle. That's going to be one kill from 404. They managed to bring it down to a tie in players 2v2. Oh, got zero with a kill on apartments. 2v1 now. Got zero and Snappy. Snappy is going to spot him trying to one tap. Let's see what Devast can do with the P350 here. Trying to shoot at Snappy, but Snappy is right there to take him down. That's the first pistol round going uh, to DM once again. Well, this round came actually closer to going to the other team. K7 could have lost this round. So, uh, at least they're yeah. doing something right on the CT side. At some point, yeah. But I think um, K7 still kind of dominate. Yes. So, anyway. So, let's jump into the second round now. Uh, the DMK7 is going to switch up their sites. They're going to be going uh, B now. Another rush from them. But soon after 4, 4 legendary... Right there on Archers to take down two people. Ken is trying to go for the third as well. That's It's not going to be him, but uh, they're going to take him down. Pronix with the UMP now. 1v4. One minute. He doesn't have the bomb. That's his problem right now. He could rotate a good uh, play some you know, strategies, but the bomb isn't in his position. There's no real point on, in saving a UMP, really. So mm -hmm. I think he should be trying to do something, but... At least trying to uh, re mess up their economy, get a couple of kills, pick some of them yeah. off or something, because there's not much he could do here. He doesn't have bomb. Yeah, especially when your time is not is just ticking and uh, you're run running low on time and uh, can't really do anything. You know, 40 seconds, has to get four kills or pick up the bomb and plant. That's almost impossible for him. So this seems like the f first round... 404 in this half. Yeah, he's going to get tagged down to 24 HP. A flashbang. He's going to try to push. Going to try and get a kill. Can he though? No, he can't. 8 HP. Reloading his UMP. Looking for the kill. He really wants it. Keeps re-peaking. But that's a jump shot from the enemy team. All players alive for 404. That's going to be the first round um, of this half. Second round of this game. Going uh, to... 404. King 7 rushed on um, this round, rushed into the site, and the person who was in arches was able to pick him off. So I think that's something yeah, they you did know, wrong this round. You know, uh, that's what this game is kind of lacking. Um, I really don't see any strategy so far. I only see rushes from both teams. So 404 was rushing their wall game, and it really wasn't working out for them. DM is also rushing right now. Uh, two rounds in a row, they rushed, and... Uh, Got the pistol round, didn't get the other one. So let's see what they're going to do now. You don't see 
any movement from them. That's going to be the first two kills of this round. Um, 3v3 now. Uh, that's going to be Stezzy rotating off to A site to help his teammate. We, we can see Wax here. P90 in the game. That's interesting. Um, AKR against the P90. That's 2v2 situation. 50 seconds on the clock. DM trying to pick up the bomb. And plant. We got Snippy on CT here. He's going to get a nice headshot. Trying to go for the second kill. Can he get it? He's going to tag him, but that's not going to be a kill. But uh, Flown is right there to assist his teammate and get the kill. That's 2-1 on the scoreboard for DM. DM once again taking the lead. Uh, that's how you play this round. Like, this was a good round right here, in my opinion. Both teams were uh, performing right. It was pretty good. This was pretty good, yeah. 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 Um... Uh, I will mention this once again. I've mentioned this like um, a lot in the past matches, and I'll mention what it once again. This is what the comp scene really lacks: strategies on the CT side. But I really hope it will change when the uh, 5v5 comes out uh, in the pro league. So I really hope there will be some strategies on the CT side. Anyways, a uh, 1v4 situation, legendary has less left all these teammates to die that's going to be him going down as well so really fast round all players alive from dm they're just showing their dominant performance once again three one on the scoreboard they trying to get it to eight one once again i'm really curious if they can yes i agree with you completely with the with, if the update comes out this will open up a lot of um tournaments 5v5s this really helped the comp scene a lot Yes, yeah, so Pro League has already announced that they will be 5v5. I'm really looking forward to it. So it will be a lot of opportunities. It will be the first big uh, 5v5 tournament in the game as well. So I'm really looking forward to it. Anyways, let's continue with the game now. 3 1 on scoreboard, as I said. That's going to be the. Uh, oh, oh. Uh, two kills from K7. Um, Sorry, me, pardon me right there. So, 3v2, the bomb's being uh, planted on A site. Let's see what 404 can do here. Flown and his teammate hiding under the balcony here. Weird choice. And that's going to be two really fast kills, bringing DM another round. All right. Okay, so now we're spectating the T side. They're flashing on pillars. See, it's just basic two, two A, two B situation right here. Yes, yeah, so they're holding their corners perfectly. Looks like there's some shots being fired on B side. All right, no kill. Oh, oh it's the two V, two V four situation. One in cubbies. He's taking a shot and he's dead. One's taking off on bananas. He's taking shots through the smoke. Okay, let's see if he can do this here. Pre-fire. He's tagged. And he couldn't finish the kill. Well, that's another round gone for K7. And that's really dominant. What can I say? There's not really much to say. 404 definitely has to change something. It's 5-1. Last half they won 8-1. They have to at least just win some rounds for the respect, even if they don't win the game. Because yeah, right now, sure. it's just really dominant by K7. Maybe, maybe we might see another 8-1 here. All right, so K7, again, is going A. Looks like they're pushing it. One, one of bomb is up top. So it's two up top, two under. One has a sniper. Okay, they're playing it really slow here. Want look in their corners. This pre-fire is going up top. So... The other team definitely knows they're up there. Okay, K7 lost a member. It's a 4v3 now. They going down on site, trying to get some pre-fires. Flashes it. He didn't jump down. He's jumping down now. Takes one out. 3v3, 3v2 situation. 2v2 situation. There's one on site. Ah, he couldn't get the kill. God zero left with the sniper. I think he's flashed. Not much to do here, and he's dead. <clears throat> All right, that's round so, over. 4-4 winning the second round. So, three rounds in total. Um, one in this game so far by 4-4. Four four. 
mm-hmm. and that's 13 rounds by DM. So 10 round difference, really, really insane. In the finals, right. this is just really rare to see this kind of dominance in the finals of a tournament. We also got to acknowledge this is the second game. So if they, they lose this, that's it. So... Three v two situation here. DM has more uh, more player bomb is planted on site. Shots being fired on mid. There's people in double doors. Oh, K seven gets the round. All right, so that's what like six six one six two. Six two, yeah. Yes. Okay. So once again, D four me and Meditare taking the rounds once again. I really want 404 to step up. I really want uh, 404 just to start doing something. I really want this to be an interesting game because so far, I mean, come on, come on. Yes, I, I'm, I'm, I'm saying what you're saying. Oh, man. Okay. So, okay, bomb is being planted on site. Two down, so it's a 3v2. No, 4v2. Oh, and this, map. this is going by really quickly. All right, the sniper has been saved, so let's see what's going to happen. This is the last round. If K7, King 7 wins this, it will be over. Let's see what 404 could do. Yeah, so, um, well, not much to analyze. It's just let's see the game, let's watch the game. This might be the last round. Really fast so far. The game's just, it's been. Like two halves and it's been like what, fifteen, twenty minutes? Like mm-hmm. really far. Yes. I have no idea what was going on before. This is the finals, right? So we should be seeing it is more the finals. even teams, but I guess with the roster change or whatever, not having the main players, this probably did something to four. Oh, four or four got the round, so Yeah, well see. um might do they're not gonna give here. up yet. They're not, they're gonna, not gonna give, give up, up yet. Yeah. Um about what you said it's uh, 404 is really like, I haven't seen much from them in the pro scene for a while now. They kind of, uh, I think they're kind of like dying a bit, you can say, say uh, pardon me. So I think they, uh, you, especially, enthusiasm. yeah, especially when you, uh, like, especially when they don't have their main players, uh, their real players, when they're playing with subs, it's kind of really weak from them. So they're not in their best uh, shape, you know. So, yeah, but they've made it this far, so they have to have been doing something right. Okay, now it's 1v, snappy by himself, 2v1 situation here, one up top, and snappy couldn't get the kill. So 7 4 now. They're really trying, they're trying to get this, so they're not giving up. That's that's good, that's very good. Yeah, I'm really happy to see them just win a few rounds. They- just pay like right now. I feel like they're just playing for their reputation because yes. I really don't think I'm pessimistic, but I really don't think there is any chance for them to win at seven four. Uh, mm-hmm. So I think they're kind of playing for th- their reputation right now. Yes, but it's still kind of nice to see you know them not giving up uh, when they like them not cracking. They can still yeah. win rounds. Well, let's see what they could do here. It's a 4v2 situation here. One's with a sniper, the other one's with an AK. 1v4 now, and he's dead. That's it. K7 takes the win. 8-4. So, guys, um, this was just insane. I mean, uh, two really dominant rounds from... Um, the Formia Military King 7 8 1 and 8 4 when I saw it correctly. So, I mean, we had a really great tournament, we had a lot of good teams, and in the end, we have first place DM. Congratulations to DMK7 and congratulations to 404 as well to t- uh, taking the t- uh, second place. And the third place, we have Saints. So really great really nice competition here and i am looking forward to see more esports action in this channel so guys if you like the stream if you like um our project here please make sure to subscribe our youtube channel it will help us a lot 
we are planning to bring real money prizes in the future to this tournament and please follow our socials as well make sure to support us thanks alien for casting yes it was a pleasure it was a pleasure man yeah thanks cammy to being with us no problem thank you for um, giving me a chance it was a pleasure and we together wish you a really good evening peace out bye bye bye